Denison Hill is this residency program in Upstate created to give artists some time to just like spend in nature. It started with Denison Hill's statement of how they call time during the residency, they just call it the downbeat, which is a, a way of describing this slowing down of the passage of time. Artists during the residency have like this time for slowing down and contemplate, more like creating a mood and an atmosphere. There is this kind of musicality to our concept of the downbeat itself, it's something borrowed from musical language basically. We ended up having these artworks that were insinuating something the way that time would be adapted in Autumn Night's piece. At some point the artist ceases to work and then the audience takes up the, the mark making and revealing what's behind the surface of the drawings. So I think the North Gallery has this more mathematical and structural kind of feeling to it. We decided to show seven sisters from Emma because of the uh, relationship that like her work has to like quantum physics, time and space bending. So these drawings at some point look even like formula somehow. The uh, North Gallery dramatically is like a really monochromatic. Most of the works are either black and white or very few colors. And then we transition into the South Gallery via Pelena Kiki Brown's works, which the series is called Crossings. So we decided to place some of the works throughout the corridor. When we cross to the South Gallery, there is this other kind of time that is much more like natural ways of behaving and being. This like sense of bliss that you get into with the flowers of Joseph Liatella's piece. Also the music and the sound that is happening in the South Gallery is like a really important element. We have like many like elements of nature, like the flowers and then like the breathing patterns, for example, in Carlos hand blown glass pieces, which are like basically exhalations of the artist congealed in, in glass. That's another really nice thing. I mean, the fact that many of the senses are engaged. Sojourner's paintings were actually made at Denison Hill, though then I think that's really important that we have like work that was made during the residency and not just talking about this slowing down of time but actually happening in that pace and in that space. <laughs> 